So day three kicks off then with the Irish Champion Hurdle, Grade One. Of course, over two miles. Five-year-olds and upwards in the top one is Bonner's Aries for Paul Rhodes. Understory Rebel for Leon Ryan Rensburg. Universal Rule for Hems. Bride of Doom. Joshua Sutherland. Chatterbury. Altos for Ryan Costello. Megan's Ziara for Hems. And Unundlish Geschitscher for Leon Van Rensburg. The hot favourite. It'll be an interesting race. They called in and away they go. And it's Unundlish Geschitscher, who is the first one to show as usual. Goes on into a two length lead, and now it's just going to be a case of whether anything can get past her. Bonazeris is in second, a stable companion under Tory Rebel is in third, and then Universal Rule. Megan Ziara closest to us, Bride of Doom, tucked in behind them, and then the windmill chasing Chatterbury Altos is the bat marker. With the first of the eight, then. And the favourite is well clear already. Five lengths. Is this one going to turn the champion hurdle and jump them into a procession in a couple of weeks? Well, we see a really small field with everybody else going for the other prizes instead, but you never know what might happen, especially at Cheltenham. Unleashed Gashitcha is the leader at the moment by about five lengths. Understory Ripple second, Bride of Doom third, and the Grey Universal Rule is after that one. Bonner's area just tucked on the inside as they take the second. And then Megan's Ziara in the middle of that pack. We've already Chatterbury Altos well out of touch. And they take the third. On and Lichka Shitcha. I seem to be getting worse at saying that as the weeks go on. I don't know why. But, uh, <laughs> it's four lengths clear anyway. And Bride of Doom in second. Understory Rebel is third. Megan's Ziara is fourth, Bonner's Aries is fifth, Universal Rule is sixth, and Chatterbury Altos is somewhere adrift. They're already at the halfway point then. And over the fourth flight, that's the halfway point in the jumping done as well now. Unindelish Geschichte is the clear leader by about four lengths. The Bride of Doom second. Take the third from home, and fourth from home, sorry. And I don't know where that one they go. Past that funny little bit of spectator area, which is oddly placed. And Unindlished Geschichte is only three lengths clear now. As they get down to the third last, I don't know where that one they go. Universe Understory Rebel is second, the Universal Rule is third. And Bride of Doom, Bonner's Aries, and Megan Ziara. This is on in earnest, and Unleash Geschichte have been pushed along now to keep up the work. The trainers said in the forums that she only does as much as she needs to to win. So I don't really expect to see her pulling away and winning by 20 lengths as they take the second last. <clears throat> Probably will go and do that now. And I've said that, but it's Unleash Geschichte who is clear on the story Rebel as they enter the final two and a half furlongs. Universal rule on the outside is third. This is the final flight. Suddenly coming under pressure now. The leader impressed by stable companion under story rebel. Universal rule on the outside. Bonner's air is trying to get into it. This is the final flight. How are they going to take it? And at least Geschichte went right through it and has lost the lead. And stable companion under story rebel has gone on. Here comes Bonner's air. Is going to try and fight back inside the final half final, but that mistake and the final flight has cost it a race. And stable companion under story rebel was a bit of an upset. And at least Geschichte is second. Bonner's air is third, then Universal Rule, Bride of Doom, Megan Ziara, and eventually Chatterbury Altos. And I think that Unleash Geschichte would probably have won that if she hadn't have walloped the final flight. And at least Leon van Rinsburg can be happy with the fact that he's one of his own that's beaten him. So. There it is then, understory rebel for Leon van Rensburg, the winner, Unendlichke Schitschke for Leon van Rensburg was second, Bonner's Aries, Paul Rhodes third, Universal Rule, Hems fourth, and Bride of Doom for Joshua Sutherland was fifth.